Cortelia's sweet sister hunt the moon to me. Aurora, you look wretched. Not fit for nobility. A ruler you will never be when you parade around so commonly. You were always sweet to me. I never liked the way you smiled, or the way you chewed your food, the way you ran through the halls, your cheerful mood. You were a perfect disgrace, and I, Crepusculum, aim to put you in your place. Oh. Time for big attacks. Jeez. Oh, damn, he heals. With the interrupt. It's a little bit, very difficult to not interrupt him. And those counter physical interactions. Help. Those hits are extreme. Finally! And then I get paralyzed. Great. At least you'll see different party members we have, which I haven't played with as before, and I can experience them as well. Interrupted, of course.
There's a third one. I didn't notice that one. Let's go for main zone. This close. All right. Now the boss itself. Damage and then lightning ray, a light ray. Only twenty. Physical works. This is extreme. I get Robert. Robert is uh, physical. Yeah. <laughs> 
Quick time. Jeez. That was... One of the hardest fights so far. Or well, one of the most stressful ones, eh? Anyway. If not the most stressful. Tumble Diamond. The moon yours for now shall be. But mother will end you, wait and see. We got the moon. Oh. Wow, where did Aurora go? Did Nicholas have you become smaller? Maybe it's the light of the moon, but I think you've gotten taller. Who cares what size Aurora is? We just killed the dragon, what a, what a team. Our strength drowns the competition. To the extreme, what do we do now? We must recover the sun to the lowest of the low. Quickly, let us run. Oh. Aurora seems older now. Counter attack. Hmm? Oh, cost two. Reduces damage from attacks by 80% and increase speed and timer by 70% for the following turn. Consider the percent chance to heal 150. Let's go down this road. Craft a few more Oculi. Plus, I have the diamond. What does it do? Increase speed by 2. Earn an additional 10% XP from each battle. Increase casting speed by 6%. That's useful. New Aurora! Let's see if there is something here. Oh! Random confession! Number 14. For Mr. Elm's eyes only, I heard strange sounds in the forest again last night. I am worried that someone from the club followed me. I found the hut exactly where it was marked in the book. But you aren't here. Where are you? Sophie Ashton Ellis. There are four more confessions to go. This one as well. Can't get it picked again. Because why not? No, there are no more confessions, right? 